Okay, we're reviewing the Toto Washlet today. This is a bidet toilet. Um, it has many options for washing in the front and the rear, and it has a dryer option. It has a position, movement, and pressure, oscillating water, cleaning, and pulsating in the drying mode. It has a heated seat, and um, it has energy saver, and it's pretty smart. It knows when you're not on it, so it won't let you just have your kids come up and push the button. Um, you, it's recommended that you have an outlet by your toilet that you can plug it into. Uh, we had one installed. Um, it's got kind of a concave uh, lid, which I'm not sure that I love that part of it because it's not super strong. It's plastic here, but I think a lot of them are going to be like that, so I'm not really sure about other ones, but um, I do like being able to just sit down on the toilet seat to maybe pluck your eyebrows or do your makeup um, if you don't have space in your home as much um, as you might want. Um, so I'm not sure that this seat would be ideal for that, but um, it opens up and it has a cleaning area and it doesn't let you just um, come up and push the buttons. It should not be spraying at me. See pretty nice um, but it will know like when you sit down on it let me see if I can put some even weight on here so it's starting to get ready to clean the nozzle I don't know if it will still spray I don't think it will and the nozzle comes out Well, that works. I haven't been able to replicate that before because it didn't sense even a weight on there. Um, and then you can use the dryer function. It uh, normally would not spray around like that because you'd be sitting on the seat. So I haven't had any issues with splashback. But it is really nice to come and sit down on a warm, nice seat. So if you're interested in a bidet toilet, which we experienced one on our vacation in Hawaii, you might find that this one is a good fit for you. Thanks, have a great day.